going to talk about travel. So I think that most of the people love to travel, and so do I. I want to travel around the world, and to me, I'm interested in many countries. One of them is Spain. In Spain, there are many Asian cultures, such as bullfighting and flamenco dance. Also, there are so many delicious food. So, in order to know more about Spain, I'm going to interview a friend who has been to Spain before. Hope that I can get more information from her. Let's go. Yes. Okay, so I know that you have been to Spain before, right? Yeah. So when did you go there, and how long have you stayed in Spain? Um, I went there about two years ago, and I spent two weeks in Spain. Do you go to a particular city or several cities? I visited several cities. For example, I went to Madrid,、uh, which is the capital of Spain, and also Barcelona and Seville. And I also spent some time in the city at the countryside named Mijas. So are those cities in a particular area or?、Uh, not actually, because we took the domestic flight and we can move from place to place. Okay. And did you visit some famous historical spots?、Um, yes, I visited a famous church called Sagrada Familia, <laughs> <laughs> and also a park called Parkwell. And these two spots are both located in Barcelona, and they are both designed by a famous architect named Gaudí. Wow. So how about food? Have you tried some delicious or special food?、Um, yeah, I I tried、uh, the bull tail stew and roast piglet. I I really loved it. And I also tried、uh, the famous Spanish dish called paella. What's that? Um, it is、uh, Spanish. Seafood rice, and it can it can also be cooked with chicken or some other meats.、Oh, so is it good? <laughs> um, it's supposed to be good, but the restaurant we went to is not as famous, so I didn't really like it. But maybe I can、uh, next time if I have the chance. I maybe I will visit Spain again and try the real Spanish rice. <laughs> Okay, so are there any special events that have impressed you? <laughs>、um, when I was walking around at the square in Spain, a, a person dressed like Mr. Bean came and talked to me, and he asked to take some photos with me. I think originally he wants to sell his photos, but he put his arm around me like this, <laughs> and I was totally frightened. So、um, my mom came and rescued me from the weird man. <laughs> So after two weeks trip in there, what do you think about Spain, such as environment or culture or food?、Um, I really enjoyed the trip to Spain because I finally got to see the fantastic architecture and culture of Spain.、Um, I watched the famous dance show called Flamenco,、oh. and <laughs> the dancers wore wore long dresses, and there are、uh, many dancers on stage, and we can eat some good food. Uh, while watching their performance, and also I enjoy Spanish food a lot. Do you think there are any differences between Spain or and Asian countries?、Um, I went to Korea and Japan, and in those two countries、uh, we can see many temples, but in Spain because it's in Europe, so we don't see many temples.、Uh, instead, we see cathedrals a lot. In Spain, there are many famous cathedrals and. I think this is the most obvious difference between like Asian countries and Europe countries, like in terms of like their architecture is different.、Mm -hmm. So I remember that you are learning Spanish, right? Can、yeah. you tell me that why did you choose Spanish rather than other languages? Is it because that you have been to Spain that influenced your decision?、Mm, yeah, because、um, I chose to learn Spanish be、uh, because of my trip to Spain and. One time, when I was finding the toilet in the supermarket, I asked the clerk, "Where's the toilet?" And she she cannot understand my question so well. And I after that, I shortened the question into toilet, and she she point to she point her finger into a certain direction, and I find the toilet, and I found the toilet. So 
um, they cannot. Spanish people cannot actually understand a full sentence of、uh, English so well. So they can only understand the simple phrases. So I decided to learn Spanish. And also another time when I was like、uh, when a boy, a Spanish boy, dropped his things on the floor, and I pick up for him, and he answered me. Gracias, which means thank you in English. And but in Taiwan, we when we see a foreigner, we tend to use English to the person. And in Spanish, they don't actually use English. So that's why I I want to learn a new language, which is Spanish in college. So after learning Spanish, would you want to go to Spain again? Yeah, because now I have. Uh, one year experience of learning Spanish, so maybe if I had the, yeah, if I have the chance to go to Spain again, I can use some daily conversation and talk with local people next time. Okay, so I hope you can fulfill your dream. <laughs> and you. this is the end of our interview. And thank you.